The Dean's provided us with another brief this week, um, it was not very specific, he just said make a viral video, obviously something that will spread on the internet quickly, mm -hmm. um, and so I thought, you know, why don't we just ask Benny Parkour, he's a local guy, he's a student here actually, he runs around the campus and he just jumps off things and I thought it would be pretty interesting and intense, so, you know, I asked him if he'd like to be involved. Benny, Benny, how would you like to be in an ad for Griffith? No. And of course he didn't, because you're not assertive, and you don't know how to get people to do what you say. I don't, but, I don't know about that. He was probably just busy or something. Well, just... he wasn't. I know what he's up to. He does fuck all. Having said that, I wrote this ad. It's called an action. It's called Action Ad. An action? A it's called Action Ad by Elliot Munro. Sounds great. And it is actually, and because people actually listen to me when I tell them to do things and um, respect what I have to say, I've managed to secure us this guy called Tom from Nathan Campus. His Asian name is Zhao Yi, and he's really good at martial arts. So we got him on board. But the exciting thing is, today, we are interviewing a girl for the role of Hot Girl. Not a very good name, but well, yeah, I'm pretty is, excited. We are very excited about that. Should be cool, yeah. And um, I've looked her up on Facebook, and she looks really good. She could mm -hmm. be a model. And she's not a Decepticon either, because even the photos she's tagged in look good. It's so. bonus. Sorry about this, he's running a little bit late. I think he's getting changed or something, which is a bit weird, but you know, it's Elliot. Luke, hey, it's Jess. Yeah, it is, yeah. Hi, Jess, sorry, I didn't know you were coming today. Hi, um, I spoke to you this morning. Don't worry about it. Do you guys want to go in? Sounds fine. You get started right yeah. now? You're okay? Okay. Cool. You might be wondering why we've sort of mic'd up and camera up the room. What we do when we do these sort of interviews, we just record everything, just so okay. we have a record. This is the first time I've done one of these. Well, we've got to start somewhere, so... Um, so I'll to Just take a seat on the couch and frame up your shot, actually. Okay. Beautiful. Little smile. A little longer smile. A bit longer smile. It's a beautiful little smile. Okay, how did you hear about us? Um, actually, I thought you called me, so... Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Correct. So who are we? You're asking. Are yes. you? Yeah. Who are you? Who are we? I'm Elliot, this is Luke, and we are ad makers, alright? We make ads. Sort of like filmmakers, except just ads. Okay. Like little short films that advertise. Mm -hmm. Okay, so ads, advertise, makers. Us. Make sense so yeah. far? You're following? Yeah, got it. Cool, okay. Before we make the ads, we shoot an audition tape, and that's what's going on here. You've got your camera, you've got your boom, you've got your mic, okay. so we can hear everything and see everything that's going on in the room. That's how cameras work. Now, how old are you? I just turned 18. Just turned 18. Do you have any ID on you? Um, I do, actually. I... Cool. We're just 18. Shout out to the camera. 18. The tender age. Yes. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Take that back. Actually, while you're standing, smell this on my wrist there. What's that? Yeah, what do you think that is? Um. Perfume. 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 Kelvin Klein cologne, actually, for men. Costs about eighty dollars a bottle. Oh. Guess how much I got it for? Um, seventy dollars. Yeah, around that. Seventy, seventy-five. Correct. Good guess. Good guess. It's all about who you know. And I know the right people, because I know producers from Australia and around the world. And I can send this tape to them and then get you jobs that pay from $1,000 to $5,000 a day. Wow. Does that sound like something you might be interested in? Yeah, it's a lot of money. Yeah, it is a lot of money. Now, when we're going to shoot this tape, you usually be working with a male talent. Okay. But there isn't one here apart from Luke. So we're just going to see how you interact with me and take instructions. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do a little role play exercise. This won't be included in the ad, but it's sort of good to work out, you know, who you're going to be working with. So, we're just going to do a little bit of role no, play? No, we're not. 
Well, we are. Now sit down. No, we are. I've seen this before. This is not. No, it's fine. No. It's fine. This, this is real. This, this is real life. Yeah, I know. It happens all the it's time. Real? No, you can't. This do happens it. all the time. No, it doesn't. This is not what happens. This. Well, this is what we signed up for. We're not doing. It? I didn't sign we up need, for this. We need. We need these sort of benefits if we're going to be doing this no. Griffith ad. No. No. All right, don't just, do it. I'm going to do it. Even though Jess is already a student here. Um, today, Elliot decided to show around campus. It's not relevant to the ad at all. And so what this room here is, you can actually stand on the stage and there's a blue behind you and we take out the blue and then we replace it with anything you want. It's how oh. they did the movie Avatar. Yeah, I've seen Avatar? Yeah, I've seen it, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's about these aliens from the future and they go to another planet and um, they go inside. Yeah, I know, I've seen it. Yeah, yeah, it's directed by James Cameron who also did uh, Titanic. Yeah, it's about I a know. ship. It's about a ship. It's a ship and it sinks. Yeah, it's a yeah. Ice she's bird. seen. She's yeah. seen. But this is our art studio in here. Um, actually, you might be interested in this because they actually do some modelling in here. Oh, okay. Yeah. Actually, I've got to warn you that a lot of it is live drawing, which is sort of nude modelling. So, <laughs> yeah, let us know if you're going to do that. Okay. <laughs> Seriously, though, let us know because that would be interesting. Okay. Um, My point is that. I am only spending time with Jess because I want her to be comfortable with the script and she the She doesn't location. have any lines. She plays a very important role. She's, She's in the film for like four seconds. Best four seconds of the ad, if you're in my opinion. Yeah, but J.I.E.'s in it for like a whole thing. And you said, have you met up with him once? I sent him a message on Facebook. He's always unavailable. So I've Just actually... Beside the point, she says that you're starting to creep her out. Well, she would never say that. She is an angel and you are telling a lie. No, yesterday I had coffee with Jess and she said that it's starting to get a little bit weird. So. I mean, you're probably just trying to make me look bad if you had coffee with her. You probably, and you're the weird one anyway. Why are you even asking around on coffee dates? I didn't ask her, she asked me. Yeah, well, I don't, I don't care. If you're thinking that I do, you're wrong. Yeah, it's like that. Yeah, I got that idea. Yeah. yeah. Put no. on the water. That's it. What do I think of today? I think it's gone okay. I think everyone's working together. I do have a problem with Luke though, because he hasn't been pulling his weight, no one has to pick up his slack, and no one is giving me many compliments on how cool I look during the ad, and I think that deserves to be mentioned. But you know, you gotta work with what you got, and I'm working with a fat dickhead. Well, it's where people see, if you see someone on the side of the road and you're like, oh, they're, they're good looking, you, yeah. you text it into the newspaper, Yeah. then it comes up, yeah, you kind of have conversations over that, it's quite okay. funny. <laughs> and people like talk back and forward through the... Yeah, through the newspaper, texting. That's silly. Yeah, it's a bit strange. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Hey, man. For that time. Hey. <laughs> oh, are you listening? Yeah, I was listening. I was just. Yeah. I thought there was one actually that you put in there for me. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> no, I didn't know. I, didn't do that. <laughs> I don't know why I would do that, though. I mean, because we're good mates. We're good mates. Well, we're filming the ad. Yeah, we're no, yeah, we're just having something to drink. Yeah. Yeah, well, I don't see any cups. I just, we're waiting for it to boil. Yeah, I'm just wondering because your name is on the director's credit, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, Elliot and Luke. Yeah, sorry, directors. it was my fault. I brought him up here. Yeah, it's fine. That's not your fault. You couldn't do anything wrong. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so let's, let's do it now, let's do it now. Who do you like more? What are you talking about? Who do you like more? Out of you two. What? Out of you two. Yeah, who do you, who would, who do you, you like to, more? You don't have to do this. Well, yeah, we do have to do it. We can just, just cut, no. let's just cut it. Why are you weird? Cut? I can't choose. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, well, you, you obviously have chosen. You don't even know us, it's just... I mean, because I'm out there, I'm doing all that cool stuff, all yeah, that we'll, we'll karate see, we'll stuff. We'll see it later on film, it doesn't matter. Yeah, but I, I do it because I think it's going to impress someone, and it doesn't. Because you're in here talking. You're talking about Jess. Yeah. No, I'm not. Not necessarily. Me. Well, is it impressing you? Um, I haven't really seen it yet, but yeah. it sounds pretty cool. Yeah, I know you haven't seen it because you're not taking interest because you're too busy talking with this idiot. I'm sick of it. Sorry. Yeah. So you saw what he was doing over there? Yeah, it was a bit immature. Yeah, I know. That's what I have to deal with, isn't it? He's already said to you that I freaked out. Yeah, like, see, the thing is, the funny thing is, I don't care. Do you know what I mean? Like, why would I freak out if I don't care? Because, like, the girls I get are so much hotter than her anyway. And there's more of them, too. Like, that's just one girl that he's got. And he hasn't even got it. Do you know what I mean? Like, like, come to me when Luke has four girls. And I would say, call the police. Because I would hold grave concerns for their safety. You're doing a good job.
day of the pitch, day of the pitch, my favourite day of the week. Day of the pitch, day of the pitch, my favourite day of the week. Come on, day of the pitch, day of the pitch, my favourite day of the week. Day of the pitch, day of the pitch, my favourite day of the week. We're all in day of the pitch, day of the pitch, my favourite day of the week. Day. We're all involved. You got the script? No problems then? No, it was fine. Actually, girls, I was a little bit worried about this one. But then I remembered the video that you'd done. I was deeply ashamed of myself that I doubted you. That's understandable. Yeah. Okay, let's go then. Alrighty. Elliot wrote this one. We hope you like it. Take it away. Add to make yourself look cool. No. Well, it says on Facebook, hey everybody, just check out this ad and see how cool I look. Has anyone clicked like? No. I didn't actually tell you to click like on that. I'm not doing that. Could you actually just click like so then people won't be shy too? Are you serious? Well, I'm not shy too. I'm signing in straight away. I thought it was fantastic. Thank you. Play it again. I'm just play on that. Yeah. When I look at that, I see a university on fire, in a good way. And I see a scholarship and a couple of laptops for the library. I didn't see any of that. People are going to be talking about us for years. This is just going to go, it's going to go viral, it's going to be fantastic. You've come to the university, you've worked hard, and now you're shining. And you're making me look shining. You're making me shine, not just shining. You've done such a great job. I'm so proud of you. Luke, Elliot, this is a great day for us. This is a great day for the university. Thank you, boys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're such good boys. Such good looking boys. Um, Elliot saw a few missed calls from Jess on my phone and um, he gave me a clue, he said Stephen Stockwell, which means that he's hidden it in the Dropbox again. So real mature Elliot. So just waiting for security to come and open it up. Yesterday we had the meeting with the Dean, it went really well. Uh, Deborah didn't like it again, but you know, we're not out to impress her anyway. You are. What do you mean? You're out to impress her, it's by the... By the way you dress, you have to impress everyone. Everyone, what do you? Yeah. Is there a message you're trying to get across here? Or? So look, you, ever since you think you are getting in with girls, you've started dressing differently. Like, look are at, you still cut about the dress thing? Not, I don't care about the dress thing, is my point. I've made it very clear. Well then what is your problem? I'm just saying, why are you wearing those fancy red shoes? I always wear the red shoes. Th he thinks he's Mr. Fancy, with his fancy, show him your fancy shoes. I don't have to show them anything. Mr. F Look, you think you're dancing your way into some fancy <sighs> relationships. Dancing. You're not Mr. Fancy. And Just get over it. You're not going to get in with... Uh, uh, uh. 
next week we're going to be doing um, like a little interview with the GI mates. Your voice Do you is actually so know? boring. No wonder your mum left. <laughs>